Hi guys, so this video is a request. It was requested by Makeup8, M-K-U-P-8. It was for a blue and brown look. Okay, so I've decided for this look I'm going to use the 88 palette. Just because it's accessible for everybody really. Um, you know, it's affordable, you get them on eBay quite cheap as well. So, the first colour I'm going to use is that baby blue there. So it's like one row up from the catch and three in. So, just going to pat that all over the lid. Sorry, as ever, like my mirror's over that way. So, I'm going to keep looking away from the camera to make sure. Okay, then I'm going to take the white colour from the very top corner, just on a pencil brush, and just dab that on the inner corner, just to get a wee highlight, and just blend the blue down into it, so it doesn't stand out as just an actual white patch in the eyeshadow. Okay, and then for brown, whoop, I'm going to use that colour there. Okay, so it's quite a dark brown, but it works. Okay, so get it on your brush. Just going to bring it part way in. Before I start to swirl it into the crease. It's quite high up on this side, so make sure they match. Even if yours isn't high up, matching still good. Okay, then take a big fluffy blending brush, blend that out a bit. Okay, and then add a bit more because it goes a little bit pale when you blend it, so build up a layer or two. Unless you want to keep it pale, in which case, you know, your choice always is. Blend it out again. Then I'm just going to take that colour there, just one up from the black, just get a little bit onto the brush and just get it right into the crease there, just for a little bit of extra definition. This is quite close to the first brown colour so you can actually get away without blending it. Then I'm just going to top up the blue a little bit. Just make sure when you do this you don't end up with a line. If you do, just blend the brown in a little bit more. Okay, they look reasonably even. I'm um, just going to brush away some fallout. Then I'm going to take, this is my 227, I always use it for highlights. I'm just going to take that second colour, it's a bit creamier. You could use the white for highlights if you like, but I don't know, I prefer this one. Just brush it on, blend it into the edges of that brown a bit so it fades out a bit nicer. Okay, and then I don't have brown liner, but if you had it, it would probably work quite well for this because it would be a bit more, a bit softer. But black's working just as well. So I'm just going to quickly lay my waterline. As you can see, um, my pen is quite even smaller. And I'm actually going to use this for my upper lash line as well. And I'm just going to put it on a really thin, wee angled brush. And just press it onto my lash line. That'll get you a nice, thin line. It still gets you to... It, this just makes it look more like your eyelashes are really thick rather than you're wearing eyeliner can take a bit of practice, but... I've not done the greatest job as well, but... Hey, we know I never do the greatest job of eyeliner on camera, so... Okay, and I'm not going to bring it all the way down there. Alright. Then I'm just going to pop on some mascara, and I'm going to put this palette away before I knock it onto my floor and break it which wouldn't be very good. Okay, 
and a little bit on the lower lashes, not too much though. This is just still my stealer mascara. It's getting a little bit dried out, so maybe have a different one on camera soon. Blusher, I'm just gonna go for a pale pink. Um, well, this isn't a pale pink, but this is Urban Decay's Quickie, so I'm just gonna put a tiny bit on. Just tapping the brush rather than swirling it. For lips, I'm going to go for Baby Sparks, so Baby Blue Eyeshadow, Baby Sparks Lip Glass. It's just a really pale, sorry, Dazzle Glass. It's a really pale pink, really sparkly, but, um, you know, it's pale pink lip gloss. Use whatever one you have. with that eyeliner because I've done on camera. Okay, well that's it smoothed out but it's a chunkier line but it looks good too actually. So, thin eyeliner, not so thin eyeliner. Both works. So, anyway yeah. So that was my look requested by Makeup 8. Just 88 palettes, quick recap. I used that blue there, that whoa, that white and that cream for my highlights, and those two browns. Okay, I hope you all enjoyed it, and if you like what you see, you know, subscribe. I'm, <laughs> I'm really excited, I've got 21 subscribers now, which seems like a lot to me, so yeah, bye guys.